What's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. Mike and I are out at Elisa Viejo Country Club today and uh, we got invited out here by a follower of the channel, new friend. His name's Tim. We're going to introduce you guys to him in a little bit, but Mike, what do you know about this course? Uh, it's a part two. <laughs> uh, it's a part 72. It is about 6,600 yards. Greens are really good out here. It's, it looks like a little bit of a link style golf course. Uh, greens are running about a 10 and a half, 11, but they're really pure, so it should be a good day. All right, guys, we're going to introduce you to Tim right now. What's up, guys? Welcome to Aliso. Thanks to Mike and Marco for coming out. Looking forward to a fun day. All right, guys, first hole here, par four, 340 yards, and it's playing a little bit left to right. Tim was saying that left center of this fairway is, uh, is a good angle for the approach shot in. And, uh, doesn't seem like there's too much trouble on the left side, and I think there's a little bit of trouble on the right side, so a couple of us are gonna take driver and just kinda try to put one down there and see if we can make a birdie on the first hole. We forgot to mention what we're gonna play for, and I think we're gonna do skins today. So, what do you wanna do? Dollar skins, two dollar skins. Yeah, two dollars. Two dollar skins. Does that okay. work for you, Tim? Two dollar skins. Two dollar skins. All right, Tim's All right. in on it. All right. <laughs> I'm like the uh, the eagle finder of golf balls. I find everything everywhere. <laughs> so I I was able to find Tim's ball, and uh, he's gonna get up and down for birdie right here. All right, Tim pushed his drive a little bit over here, and uh, you guys can kind of see he's got some uh, bushes to go over, and then the green is up there. Just a little bit long, kind of bladed it. All right, Mike and I both hit really good drives down here. He's kind of on the right, so he's gonna have to go over this bunker right in front of me. And he's probably got about a 50 yard shot, maybe a little bit more. So, but he's got plenty of green to work with. You should be able to get that up and down. And I went over here just a little bit to the left and really good angle, no bunkers in the way and pretty straightforward shot. All right, Marco's got a little side hill lie. He's got about 40 yards and probably about 35, 40 feet of green to work with. So I think he's gonna play it off to the left a little bit. Oh, he just nuked it over the green. All right, so I got about the same yardage. I got 40 yards. I gotta carry this bunker. I'm gonna aim a little bit left and uh, hopefully it'll trickle back to the right. Looks pretty good. Hit it up towards the left and it's kind of starting to roll out to the right. Coach, with the first skin, how does it feel? Boom, two dollars right in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're on hole two, it's a par four, it's 297 yards, all uphill. Tim basically said it's either 215 yards or driver, so I think we're gonna go with driver right here. There's a lot of room to the left, and uh, it's kind of tight to the right, so I think we're gonna definitely hit driver. Ball. Good ball. All right, Tim was really smart. He hit a four iron off the tee right in the middle of the fairway. He's probably got about 100 yards left. Looks good. Marco and I hit driver right next to each other. I think we got about 45 yards left. Oh, that's pretty good. Good, good one. That's pretty good. A little left. All right, Tim hit a great shot in here. He's got like a little five, six footer. And then Mike and I were both a little bit long. Um, I think that's me just on the fringe right there. And then Mike's uh, just off the backside of the green over here. He's got a touchy shot. He's coming down a hill. You guys can kind of see it right in front of me. It's all kind of sloping away from him. So he just has to get this on the green and get it going. Touch, man. <laughs> no easy money.
plenty around here. <laughs> and good up and down by Coach. Good trees, guys. Yep, well done. All right, guys, we're on hole number three. It's a par four, it's 358 yards, and it's a hard dog leg to the right. As you guys can see, uh, you can see where the pin is on the right all the way. Um, that bunker is about 260 yards out, and uh, I think we're just gonna hit driver and try and take uh, the bunkers out of play right there. Perfect. Ended up just a little bit right of the green. About pin high though. All right guys, made a great birdie on that last hole. We're gonna try to go back to back. We got 78 yards left. I'm gonna hit the lob wedge. Some of these 50 yard shots have not been going too well for me, so it's kind of good that I laid back on this one a little bit. <laughs> Looks like he went a little long with some spin. It's coming back. It's probably got about 25, 30 feet. Coach had a great drive down here. I think he's gonna have another 50 yarder, maybe even less. All right, I got 52 yards, so I'm gonna try and actually hit the screen this time and uh, try and get up and down. It sounded a little heavy, but I think it's actually gonna kick up and I think that should be pretty good. How did that feel? Uh, caught a little heavy, pulled it, but I think it got a good bounce and it should be pretty close. All right, looks like Tim just hit a really good chip shot. He's got about three feet left. I think that's me right behind the pin. I got about 10, 12 feet. And Marco just went a little bit long. He's got about 35 feet. Great up and down, good four. All right, we're on hole four, it's a par four, it's 365 yards all up the hill. Tim said you cannot miss right on this uh, hole and that bunker straight ahead is about 235 out. So I think we're gonna take driver and try and carry it. to the right, I didn't listen to Tim, I hit it in the hazard. So I've got 111 up the hill, pins on the right, so I'm just gonna aim for the middle of the green and uh, hopefully I have about 15, 20 feet. Started right at the pin with a little baby draw, this looks really good. Nice shot, dude. All right guys, I got the same yardage as I did on the last hole, 78 yards, took the lob wedge again and see if we can do a little better this time. Just left of the pin. Maybe a little bit long, but pretty good. All right, looks like Marco's the one that hit the green. I am just a little bit left and long, and looks like Tim is short and to the right. That was touchy. that little four footer and uh, gave up two skins right there. Not the way to do it guys. All right, so we're on hole five. It's a par three, it's 190 yards. Looks like that bunker on the left is just kind of the front part of the green. Don't think it's gonna come in play. The pin is all the way in the back and there's a huge ridge. So, and everything slopes left to right from what Tim said. Started just a tiny bit right of the flag and it's drawn a little bit. And it's on the green and it just kind of rolled off right fringe, but pretty good shot. All right, looks like Tim missed a little bit to the right. He's got a tough little chip shot. He's gonna go up this hill, up the ridge. Not a lot of green to work with. Um, I missed a little bit to the right, right there on the fringe. Ooh, that was really good. Got about five feet, six feet left. 
And then Marco hit a really good six iron from 190. He's got about 25, 30 footer, so right there. Great three. Thanks. Good two putt. Now you hit that firm. Yeah, finally I made one. All right, we're on hole six. It's a par four. It's 460 yards, a little bit downhill and a dog leg to the right. Um, Tim said uh, anything to the right is okay. Uh, cuts off some of the yardage on this hole. And those bunkers along uh, the left side fairway are about 275 out. Mike and I hit a couple good drives down here right next to each other. I drove them this time, but it's not about the drive. It's about the putt. Kyle Marco just loves how it drives me. It's great. Uh, I've got 138, uh, a little bit uh, into the wind, so I'm just going to knock down a smooth nine iron. Little thinny started right side of the green, and it's drawn a little bit, but it looks like it's going to be right side of the green. All right, I got about the same yardage, maybe like 136. I'm going to hit a pitching wedge, nice and firm, and uh, just go right at it. Looks like it's pin high, just to the right. Good shot. All right guys, so Tim and I both hit the green here. Uh, we're both a little bit long, and he, Tim's got about a, I don't know, 45, 50 footer going right here, and I probably got about a 30 footer. And Mike was in the mud. He told me back in the fairway that he's gonna play it, so let's, let's see what he's got here. Let's assess his lie. This looks like a fun one. A little bit long, but pretty good shot. Nice birdie there, dude. All right, man. yeah, way to end part one. If you guys are enjoying these videos, hit a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe and follow us and uh, come back for part two. You just got some skins. I got some skins. You definitely have at least one, right? I've got one. Okay. <laughs> so we'll see how this thing finishes up. And hopefully you guys are having a good day. See you for the next one.